Don't you know that I'll be around to guide you Through your weakest moments to leave them behind you Turning nightmares on we shadows Witam wszystkich bardzo serdecznie, ja jestem Aragor A to co oglądacie jest to Life is Strange w ostatnim odcinku skończyliśmy epizod czwarty pod tytułem Ciemnia, w którym się dowiedzieliśmy, że e, pan Jefferson jest we wszystkim zamieszany i część e, akcji, czyli podawanie narkotyków, on to robił. I dzisiaj właśnie polecimy dalej z historią, czyli z epizodem strange. No, czy poprzednio to było w pierwszym sezonie? What did you find? Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. We can't trust anybody except each other. You know more about her than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. What are you doing in my dorm? You are so fucking dead! <sighs> Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. <sighs> Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. What are you doing here, Max? Victoria has to be next. What a lame gimmick. Rachel, why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Ugh! Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Oh, no. Chloe. Look out. What the fuck? No. Jestem ciekawy, czy można zmienić, żeby Chloe nie umarła. No bo postrzale w głowę, wątpię, żeby to przeżyła. Nie, niemożliwe. Nie. No dobra, gdzie my teraz jesteśmy? Prawdopodobnie będziemy w ciemni. Oczywiście. Ale... Dobra, never mind. Dawaj, Max, budź się! Będę tworzyć są filmiki na YouTube. Będzie sławna. Długie wprowadzenie, bardzo długie wprowadzenie. Uuu, też można przyklejenie. Polaryzacja. No, okej. Okay. No okej, okay. i teraz y, Max kombinujemy jak się stąd wydostać, co nie? <śmiech> Ona też tu jest. Chloe? When? Where? The dark room. 
Ale patrzcie, kto tu jest na podłodze. Dobre. No, średnio to pomoże. Eee, lewą rękę najpierw uwolnij. No. Nie drzyj się. To nie pomoże. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Dobra, kombinuj, kombinuj, kombinuj. Zdjęcie. Oh shit, that's me. He took that shot last night. No go uwolnisz? Dobra. Finally, I'm free. Almost. Dobra, olej. I don't remember anything that happened. This must be the same drug Nathan used on Kate. I hate looking at myself like that. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. Dobra, ale to. Czekaj, czekaj. Skup się na zdjęciu. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. The slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure expression. Oh Christ, look at that perfect face. Hold that stare there! Stay still! Please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now, I knew you were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes, I still hate that word. But I love the purity of your own image. Not like Rachel, who was always looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Wait. Let me try this angle. He tried so hard, but you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows, and an eye for a whole lot more, as his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. Nice. Good. Oh, those eyes. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you from Nathan's phone. And you fell right into my hands. You really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe, right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed... that Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised. Or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. 
I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. Now this looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. Jefferson zginiesz, ja to ci obiecuję. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose will calm you down. Oh, no. No. Now don't move or this will hurt much. Stupid bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If you had, you might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter, though. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. Remember my number one rule. Always take a shot. Dobra, ale musimy się stąd wydostać, Max. Victoria. Hey, Victoria. It's Max. Can you hear me? Max. Oh god. Where where are we? Oh, what's happening? You've been drugged like Kate and me. Do you remember how you got here? No. I don't know. Wait. You warned me. You warned me about Nathan. Then, then I went to Jefferson for help and he was acting so weird. That's the last thing I remember. And I can't move my hands. Help me, Max. Please. I'm sorry for everything. Listen carefully. Mark Jefferson kidnapped us. He's using Nathan as well. Jefferson is very dangerous, so we have to get out of here before he comes back. Max, I just can't believe this is real. I don't want to die like this. Tak dziwne, jestem, ale... I'm only eighteen. Mom plan. Victoria, please listen. I have a plan. Really? How, Max? I'm so scared. So much. But we don't have time to be scared. We have to fight back now. Max, I can't even move my arms. How are we supposed to fight? I'm not going to let that asshole get away with this. I just, I need you to be strong. I can't do this alone. We need to act while we're clear-headed. If he toses us again, we'll forget everything. I'm not strong, Max. Look at me. Look what I did to Kate Marsh. Now she's in the hospital, and I'm here. We're both here, okay? I just can't believe this is happening. That Jefferson would do this to me, to us. Victoria, we will find a way to escape. I promise. Nie bez nas hasło do. I believe you. Do tego, do tworzenia wróz. Dobra, musimy jechać. Wow, I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. This might work. Please work. Dobra. Wise, yet so innocent. That way, Max. Oh, 
uda ci się... I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. You're the winner, Max. I choose you, your portrait. Fuck you. <laughs> You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? <laughs> Max, I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura. And those lucky few become my models. My subjects. Yes. You're a psychopath. And this is your last session. Au contraire, Max. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. As you can see, Sleeping Beauty here is too harsh for my gentle lens. And don't get me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. <laughs> Go to hell. You will for everybody you've hurt. Unlike pure sweet Kate Marsh, I don't believe in that bullshit. She could have been my masterpiece. The world is what an artist makes it. And my muse. Kate believed, and she survived. You failed to break her. She's stronger than ever, and she'll outlive you. She'll certainly outlive you. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe I'll pay Kate a visit soon and test her faith again. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. Like with an image. Nathan's was easy to twist around. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious dark room and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Hm. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. Is that what you want to hear? Why? 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 Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. I'm sorry, Max. <laughs> that was not cool. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, Max? I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. 
You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. For <laughs> Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here by your own choice. I sound too cool. I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Alone with a heart, a battered old heart. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Oh, now this one. I can see why your instant camera is so I have appealing. all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Max, to może być wyjście, ale Okay. Wait. Please, Mr. Jefferson. Max. I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures, especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. We pamiętnik. You... you still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh. Look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. Właśnie spój się, skup i cofamy się w czasie. Oof. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic trick. Right back where I started this week. And nobody of course, is going to hurt Chloe know, ever again. The portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expressions. Zostawiam mi taka dziwna poświata, co teraz mamy na dwie. I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process. Oh, well, that was easy, Max. Was it? Okay. Well, uh, okay then. So, uh, the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Obviously, Max has read them. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes to change time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, artwork. let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. And Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. No, you don't deserve it. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. Dobra, ale Pokiąc na tym skończymy odcinek Bo zeszło nam już 25 minut eee... Odcinka w ogóle Ja przepraszam, że tak strasznie cicho jestem 
E, w ogóle, tutaj ja będę leciał dalej z naszym pamiętnikiem, jednocześnie będę do was mówił. Przepraszam, że tak cicho po tego, e, podczas tego odcinka byłem, ale strasznie, strasznie, strasznie się w, e, wciągnąłem w całą tą fabułę. I musiałem to wszystko przeczytać, to było naprawdę strasznie interesujące. No i... no i dzięki temu się dowiedziałem paru rzeczy. Dobra, tam w ciemnym skończyliśmy. Teraz mamy pana Jeffersona, który jest jednak złym człowiekiem. Tada. Dobra, więc dziękuję za oglądanie. Mam nadzieję, że się Wam spodobało. Zachęcam do komentowania, lajkowania. No i zapraszam do innych odcinków. Adios!